Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine. I am Miss Nintendo HD. And in the last episode, well, there kinda was a mix up. Um apparently <laughs> it's kinda funny, um episode six got uploaded first instead of episode five. Which is kinda funny to me, but oh well. Both episodes are up now, so it's all good. And um I haven't been updating this game as much as I would like to. Um, simply because, no, make away, um, uh, my school started up, uh, on Wednesday, so I haven't had much time to record any gameplay or episodes for my channel either, so. Whoa, that was a big dive. That was awesome. So yeah, that's been the main problem, so why, um, uh, this game has not been updated as more frequently. <laughs> nice face off here between Shadow Mario and Mario. There's a uh, Serena Beach in the background. That is the next world after Peanut Park, by the way, if you didn't already know that. Ah, <laughs> oh, Flood is hilarious. So, this is technically an appearance of Bowser, but in mechanical form. Oh, give me those eyes. So obviously, since, uh, never mind. I can't put that in towards what I was going to say. <laughs> never mind, doesn't matter. Wouldn't you think, since it's standing in water, it would uh, short circuit so we wouldn't have to try and destroy it? It, it would make sense. But, Nintendo logic. Uh, it's basically you have to hit this thing five times, and enemies are basically bullet bills going across the track. Oh, I actually hit him there. Wow. Where's the bullet bells? I need a rocket, please. Bullet bells coming. Not oh, fail. So annoying that. Really irritating. Come on, hit him. Come on, give me a rocket. Please? No. Damn you. <sighs> How did you miss that? He's right there. How I missed that, I have no idea. Watch that happen from here. Yeah. Huh. I knew that would happen. Oh, you dick! Oh, wait, I hit him. What? Wait. Mm. Never mind. <laughs> Go with the flow. Is that him? That, that's him. He's done. Finished. Kaput. End of story. Goodbye. That took longer than I expected. Magic breath. When I draw with this, all my wishes come true. 
quite fair. He said, Junior, you're going to try to outsmart Mario. So I tried to get Mario to get to prison, but they didn't lock him up. And now he came to steal Mama Peach again. You, you pest, stop following us. All right, after that cutscene, we finally get our shine sprite and find out that Shadow Maru is actually Bowser Jr. Get. Uh. All right, now time for the Beach Cannon Secret. I believe the second mission is called that. I'm 100% sure now. Beach can secret it is. Now, I believe there is a glitch here where you can actually kill the mole without. Oh, good god, there's a homing bill. Oh, yeah, it closes thing, never mind. He opens it back up. Ah, I'll try and do it. Not oh, fail. I'll try. I'll try my best to do it, but I don't know if it'll work. Nah, it's not gonna happen. Oh well. God, what is wrong with me? I can't do anything today. God. Oh, it's this one as well. Great. Disappearing platforms, not my forte. And these things I do not like. Because it's hard to control, even though I just did it like that. Oh my goodness. Now we have to wait for this thing. God, no. Yep, easy as that. No, the second one. I used to always think you had to dive the whole entire thing, but basically, you just dive here, then go around, then dive. And I kind of messed that up there because I didn't time it exactly right. But, anyways, we still get the shine. Now, time for the red coin mission of this mission. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Collect 8 red coins for a time it runs out. Good luck. I was gonna do the, you know, the, never mind. Y'all know what I'm talking about anyway. Anyway, collect 8 red coins for the time it runs out. There is, uh, like, 6 red coins located in this, uh, this one area. And it has to be on the disappearing platforms. But luckily, all the platforms, like, reappear, like, Simultaneously, it's like the same time, which does help out quite a bit. And hopefully, I make it up here. Okay, sweet, that's easy enough. I need to be quick about this. Okay, awesome. That was really well done, actually. I'm quite <laughs> proud of that. Okay, sweet. Now, time for red coins in the pirate ship. I believe. Now, speaking of this mission, I'm going to play music to it. So, um, you can enjoy some Zelda dubstep music or something. I'll fit something in here because this mission is a pain in the ass. So anyway, enjoy the music.
Alright, finally we got the shine. Like that wee trick I did there where I hung under the bot. Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> I almost fell off that. I was about to say, do you like the wee trick where I hung off the bottom of this press B and hovered around? Quite like doing that. It's quite effective. So, finally we actually got that one done. Oh, God. I hate that shine. Alright, time for an easy one. The Welted Sunflowers. Now, these Pacific egg-like creatures look like Yoshis. Now this is basically about to introduce Yoshi into the game. Because after you do this mission and get the shine in Delfino Plaza, a uh, Shadow Mario or Bowser Jr. will be holding a Yoshi egg. So basically this is introducing Yoshi to the game. Yes, you would like one of them, wouldn't you? I would love to know the uh, the real name of those enemies or the ah uh, these enemies right here, because I'm trying to think what they could be called. I don't know, I'll probably look it up later on or I'll more than likely forget to. Oh well. I guess I'll never know what the name of the enemies are. Mm-hmm. Nice to know. Ah, and the last one right here. Basically this is kind of like a speedrunning tactic right here, basically after you like killed the first one, it's just like kind of sprint over to the next one. Oh my god, fail. Fail. And now the shine shall appear like right here, so I'm going to stand right here. Yep, told you, right where I predicted, right there. Alright, time for, I believe it's like, the runaway ferris wheel or something. Oh god. I've got a burp coming on, but I don't want to let it out. Alright, off screen there, I went and grabbed Yoshi. And saved and stuff, and basically all that jazz. So now Yoshi is unlockable in these levels. Well, in Delfino Plaza, he will be uh, perched on a on a rooftop where one of the bells are in Delfino Plaza. So you can go and get him there, and he also requires like one certain fruit. There's a blue coin. I just noticed that. Now, runaway Ferris wheel. Obviously, got this tip from um none other than uh, Chug Conroy, but. Yep, everyone knows this tip. Very effective if you do- Oh, uh, what?! I'll just go through that. Oh my god, really? Really? Damn Nintendo, damn. I honestly just went through that. I swear. Come on. Basically all you all of you know this tip anyway. Basically come to the top of here. Make sure you time it right. And basically fl float all the way through. Just like so. Doesn't look like you're going through, but you are indeed you are. That made no sense. And I can't see. Alright, easy enough. Instead of going all the way around to the back of the first wheel and doing all that 
crap, it is totally not necessary, can you just do it that way? And now this Ferris wheel shall slow down, and in the background you can see Serena Beach and Gelato Beach, right there, oh there's Serena Beach, Gelato Beach, Rico Harbour and Delfino Plaza. Quite cool. Where's the platforms? Ah, oh, make that. Okay, sweet. Probably have time for a couple, well, one more shine. Probably the um, Yoshi go around secret one. Then we'll do the red coin mission in the next episode. So yeah, that's what, that's what we shall do. Alright, the Yoshi go round secret. Now, hence, hence it has Yoshi in it, so obviously Yoshi's going to want a Pacific fruit, so. Now, many people obviously know this now, but Yoshi actually has to have a pair in order to get to level, not just to get Yoshi itself. Or himself, or whatever gender Yoshi actually is. Does he actually want a pair? Okay, cool. Pairs right here, easy enough. Don't ah. Uh, you had to roll right into that corner, didn't you? Should be pair. Can't believe I'm talking to a fruit, a virtual fruit at that. Makes it even worse. So basically, Yoshi has to be orange in order for you to get into the level because. Apparently, the Yoshi Go Round doesn't have enough um, orange Yoshis, so. Basically, it sacrificed the Yoshi in order to get a Shine Spray. And this one is not uh, even that hard. Maybe the first couple of bit and I died. And as soon as I say it's easy. I freaking die. Oh my god. Okay, this mission is really difficult. So difficult. Now that I say that, I won't fail. Now that I said I won't fail, I will fail. There's no end to not failing. You just have to fail. <laughs> Okay, make this sweet, awesome, fantastic. Now this part is simple as simple can get. I don't like the back. I do not like the backdrop. It's really weird. Sunflowers. Okay, let's turn the camera around so it's exactly parallel with Mario. Okay, sweet. Oh, fail! I believe you can actually just spin jump from a from the platform above. We'll try it. Luckily, I grabbed on there. If I didn't, I'd be really pissed off. Oh my god, what? Fuck you, game. Fuck you. Okay, we are back to the place that we died at. Okay, let's try this again. Fail wall jumping was fail earlier on. Let's try I think you can spin jump to this. Yes, you can. Why didn't I just do that in the first place and try and... Hmm, never mind. Oh well, so that is the end of this episode of Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine. I have been missing 10 HD. I thank you all very much for watching. Hope you leave a like and a comment. And there's Shadow Mario with the turbo nozzle, but I'll be getting those off screen, so... I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace!